That was all today Saturday. And before I close, on behalf of the organizers and the celebrant, I'd like to say to our whole But let me say that today, it isn't necessary again to tell you why you are here, because that will defeat the intelligence that way and uh, sent to you. So what I'm going to do is to focus on the relevance of what you need in a play uh, like this. So Mr. Chairman, um, we need to have pauses in our lives. We need to have Rest. Sometimes in the chief's palace, the food player to and sometimes uh, stop a little bit to wipe the sweat off his face. It is believed that we seldom make time for celebrations and we don't recognize our achievement. So when we meet like this, it offers us many opportunities. For instance, meetings like this give us opportunity to focus on what we have achieved in life so that we can take our mind off the missed opportunities. It also gives us the opportunity to reflect on some of the opportunities that we have improve on ourselves. It also offers us the opportunity to disengage from our normal routine and re-engage our mind on different things. It gives us the opportunity to learn, to network, to boost our well-being, and to also reboot the whole But Mr. Chairman, what year birthday in particular has a lot of glamour around it and is popularized by uh, some popular things like uh, life is a quality and midlife crisis. I would allow to delve into it, but we don't have time. So the little bit I can say about it is that um, a typical human life. It's made up of our origin and our destiny. And these two are mysteries to us. In between these two is life itself. And life is also a mystery. Now, a typical human life is prescribed by biology. But then, it can also be described by society. So, midlife. Crisis around a 40 is real. But one can also begin to live after 40 years if one pays attention to diet, exercise, the right mental, and strong social network. For the past 40 years, Dr. Nana Amabra Fuji has been blazing the trail. In doing so, he has left various signposts. Today, another signpost in life. Today is an important effort in life. And we are going to mark it. It is equally important to acknowledge most of you here and many more people who couldn't be here with us. Because it is through your support that is able to get where she is now. Mr. Chairman, let me add that the relevance of today's gathering identifies uniquely with every unique individual who is here with them. For instance, Mr. Nana Bumbatla is a name I've been hearing since I was in primary school in my small unique community called Lumi. 
Today, faith, effort, and chance have brought him face to face. And there are many other people here whose names I might have heard before, but I have never seen them. And today, I've met them face to face. And that one is uh, Dr. Idris Mori Idris. So, and there are many more people like that. Um, but I will appeal to the rest of us also make this event a very relevant uh, one. And I believe we have all the resources to facilitate that. To the celebrant, it is the first time you are celebrating your 40th year on planet Earth. It is also the only time you will celebrate it. Today, you are a special queen. Please, my dear, make it worthwhile. Before I take my seat, Allow me to dedicate a song to her. I invite the rest of you to enjoy. Now, let me say that the, the words of this song are not in tune a typical birthday celebration song. However, the focus is on the learner. And the learner, the song is that today is our queen and we want to grow the, our queen. Ladies and gentlemen, DJ, sit down the priest. Sarah Patti. 